Hey fellow dadpreneurs, how would you like to start your own software company for very little money? I'm talking less than $100. In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do just that. Hey, my name's Adam Dukes, and I help dads escape employment by building a wildly profitable online business so that they can enjoy more dad time. Now, software is all the rage. It's been all the rage. It is a great business to get into, but a lot of people are concerned. Uh, it costs a lot of money. It costs a lot of time to find developers. And yes, that is all very, very true. However, you're able to white label software. There are hundreds, if not thousands of pieces of software out there that the developers and or creators will allow you to white label their software. And in this video, I'm going to show you, uh, explain what white label software is. I'm going to reveal a couple of pieces of software that you can get started white labeling right now. I'll share a, a tool that I used, a very popular email platform that not many are aware of that you can actually white label. And it's actually a leader in the industry. I did it years ago, and I'm going to share a couple of tips to help increase you get more customers. So let's dive right in. How to start your own software company for less than $100. So white label, like I said, it's a software that a company uses uses and brands as its own software. So another company out there will allow white labels to pay. Typically they will charge a monthly fee. Some of it's a yearly fee. Some of it they do have an initial setup fee. Each company is different, but what they'll let, let you do is sell their software and you can brand it as your own. So it looks like you developed the software, you created the software, it's completely your own software in a way. You, in, a, in a sense, you're kind of renting it and or licensing it from the company and you can sell it and put it at, typically you can put it at whatever price tag you want. What I like to do is bundle things together to make it a higher perceived value and make it a much better offer than just the software itself. Why do this? It's a win-win. So the developer and or the creator of the software, they get more customers for their software. You're As a reseller, you are a customer of theirs. And the reseller yourself, you're offering a software without having to spend time or money on development. The reseller gets to market a, market a proven tool. Obviously, typically how it's set up is each user that you generate, let's say the software company charges you $10 a license per month, as an example, and you would charge your customer $20. So you would keep that $10. That's kind of the gist of it. And you could charge obviously whatever you want, but you can play with that a little bit. And, but like I said, I like to increase it. So years ago, I white labeled active campaign. It's one of the best email platforms out there. And I created a membership website for real estate agents and I white labeled the Auto active campaign software. I called it automated agent. I think it was. Yes, it was. And it was active campaign dashboard, but it was my logo as automated agent. And then I included some email templates for them. I included uh, Facebook ads training. I included other things to it. So I increase the value. It wasn't just an email software. It was an email software. It was Facebook ads training. It was email templates that were all set up for them. So I was able to charge more money than what active campaign. I think I was charging 37 bucks a month. Active campaign charges at the time they were charging nine dollars a month. But it wasn't a comparison. It wasn't it was apples and oranges, active campaign and automated agent, because I increased the value. So if you're gonna do white label software, I definitely recommend kind of increasing the value, making the offer more sexy, more attractive, more valuable for the user. And there are a variety of different ways you can do that. So benefits of white label software, it expands your product offerings. Whatever you're offering now, it could be a digital product, it could be a physical product, it could be a service. This is great for agencies and services. You can expand your product offering by offering a white label software. It strengthens customer loyalty. If, if customers are paying you each and every month with a software, very, very likely that they're going to stick with you longer, very likely that they're going to buy other products and or services from you. It's gonna save you time and money. The tool is already built. You don't have to worry about any of that. You can take advantage of, again, selling a proven product. Increased lifetime value. Again, software has a sticky rate. If they're using the software, that's a, that's a big part of it. They need to be using the software, but if they're using it and finding benefits from it, they're going to continue being a customer for months and months, if not years and years and years. And again, they're gonna likely buy other products and services for you because they're already paying you a monthly fee as it is. It's much easier to sell to a current customer than it is to sell to a new prospect. 
No development cost. Again, you don't have to worry about development first. Uh, back in 2015, 2014 it was, I tried to create my own software. What an epic failure that was. I spent about $3,600 on it. I had no idea what the hell I was doing. I hired someone overseas and I was creating a software where people could put in their addresses and they would get the value of their home. Zillow does it. There's a ton of companies that do it now. Back then it was relatively new. There was other companies that were doing it. I'm not kidding claiming I came up with the idea, but what an absolute headache it was. It took about three months to finally get it done, and then at the last couple of days, all of a sudden the software company said they needed an additional 3,500 for like maintenance and some other services, and I was like, what? I had no idea about this, you know? And so I had to make a tough decision. Go on with it. Are they gonna ask me for more money in a couple of months, most likely, or just cut it, just kill it, you know? So I ended up losing $3,600 in three months of time of back and forth. So uh, I should have probably just white labeled the software. It would have been much easier. Again, it would have saved me time and money and frustration and frequent trips to the liquor store because it was a stressful process. Uh, you're selling a proven product. They're already selling it to their customers. All you have to do is sell it to your customers. It's it's a win, like I said, it's a win-win uh, for all parties involved. Uh, it's like having an in-house developer at a fraction of a cost. A fraction of the cost. Now, you can't control the software. You can't make changes to the software. I mean, you could certainly make requests to make some changes to the software, but that company owns the software. They own the rights to it. They're going to do it how how they want to do it. So it, you you do lose some control with the white label, so there are some certainly some cons to it. That is the big one. They are in control of it. So here are a couple of white label software companies. So like I said, Active Campaign, one of the best email platforms uh, out there online, and they offer a white label program so you can plug and play into that. Like I said, spruce up the offer, increase the value somehow, some way, make it more sexy. Then you can charge a little bit more money and then you differentiate your offer from Active Campaign. Another one for creating landing pages is Landing Eye. I, th I have no idea how to say that, but if you want to create landing pages or offer landing pages, you could offer landing page software and they offer white label. Uh, Funnel Builder Software, Simvali. I talk about this on the channel. If you're interested in Simvali, check it out down below, adamdukes.com forward slash S. I am. They are a funnel builder software. I've used just about all the funnel builders over the years, and without a doubt, Sim Valley is the simplest one to use. It's a website, it's a CRM, and it's also a funnel builder. And soon, sometime in 2021, they're going to be offering email as well. Not sure when that comes out, but Sim Valley offers a white label service, so you could offer websites and or funnels to your customers and completely brand it as your own. I've seen quite a few entrepreneurs doing this and they're offering Simvali. They're coming up with their own name, their own logo, their own URL. And a lot of people are thinking, wow, you spent all this money on a funnel builder. Little do they know they're actually leveraging Simvali. So that is a great one if you wanted to offer funnels yourself. This is something I considered about a year and a half ago. Uh, I decided not to do it. Uh, but Simvali would be a great one to offer if you're interested in offering funnels. Uh, another Another tool is called, uh, another all-in-one tool is called Hot Prospector. This is from a buddy of mine named Mark, and it is an email, phone call, uh, text messaging, ringless voicemail. It's kind of an all-in-one tool. It's great for sales teams if you have a small sales team. If you have a, a big sales team, 500, 1,000 people, Hot Prospector is a fantastic tool to leverage. And they also offer a white label version where maybe you own a call center, perhaps. You could white label the software, and it appears that it's your software. Another one that I just uh, found doing research on this video is called Invoice Ninja. If you send out invoices and you wanted to create a uh, software yourself and you wanted to offer that, or if you have maybe uh, marketing agencies that you sell to, you could offer them uh, an invoice software that they could leverage and use to their customers and clients. Uh, this is a little bit different. This isn't a software, so to speak, but a PPC agency. So if they offer, if you offer Google advertising, Facebook advertising, Instagram, Yahoo, Bing, whatever type of pay-per-click advertising, you could hire Click Geeks and they will be your service provider. So technically not really a software, it's more like a white label service provider, which there's a bunch of those as well. Excuse me, this is a popular one, so I did wanna mention that. Another one is an app builder. If you wanted to offer app builder, there's a company called Buildfire. So you could say that you are an app developer or you create apps and you could leverage Buildfire and you pay them a monthly fee they build the apps, or I think they have a they have a tool that you use that you can build apps with no code, uh, but you could brand that yourself and say you are an app development team. 
Another tool is a social media management tool, posting on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, all the social media pl uh, the tools. Very, very hot topic, obviously, for the last several years. A uh, tool called Sensible. Again, you can white label their software and sell it to maybe marketing agencies or even small business owners if you choose. Uh, last one, I believe, is the reputation management. So people leaving negative reviews online. There is a tool called Ranker, and you could offer that again if you're selling to marketing agencies you could offer ranker as your own software and then they could go on and sell that to their customers and or clients now i've used active campaign hot prospector and simvali i have not used all the other tools so i'm not endorsing them in any way i just did a little bit of research uh, pulling this video and i found these tools mentioned on a couple of different websites uh, but do your due diligence obviously before you get into this uh, i would definitely recommend using the software over yourself if you like it if you find value in it like i said what i did with in Bali, then start maybe looking to offering it as a white label. All right, here is another tool. It's called Social Proofo. It's on the website called Code Canyon, uh, one of my favorite kind of underground gem websites. Um, so what this is, is I'll show you the website. So this is the little proof element that pops up in the lower left-hand corner when someone purchases something from your website, whether it's a Shopify website, whether it's a funnel builder, but it's social proof. And the little thing, if I refresh it, maybe it'll show up, but it has little notifications. It's very easy to install. But what this is, is so you can buy this uh, outright. Here it is right here. So these little notifications pop up. So you can buy this outright for $69 and have it yourself. No monthly fee. There's a lot of companies out there. Use Proof is the popular one, uh, but there's hundreds of other competitors out there and they all charge a monthly fee. So you could go here to Code Canyon and pick this up for $69 for lifetime. But they also offer, if you scroll down, they have an extended license for $449. What that extended license is, is you get this website right here. You get this complete website. You'd get your own branding, you'd get your own logo, you'd get your own URL, white labeling. And you could offer this as a software. And as you can see, you can set the pricing. If you wanted to have a free, a free plan, you could charge $4.99 a month, you could charge $7.99 a month, you could charge $12.99, whatever the hell you wanna charge, monthly, annual, lifetime. And so this would be your complete website with your branding if they purchase Everything is set up on the back end. If they purchase, they get an account, they are able to install these widgets on their website, these social proof widgets right here. Again, all under your own branding. This is a great one to get started. Again, this is a little bit higher priced at 449, but this is a plug and play system. You get the website, you get the back end, you get the account, all that, it's plug and play. All you have to do is send traffic to your website. Obviously customer service as well. There's gonna be people reaching out for customer service. So I don't wanna just say it's uh, just send traffic and you're money's going to fall into your bank account. So this would be a great tool to offer. Like I said, there's a lot of competitors out there uh, because this is a very, very valuable piece of software. It helps increase sales. Uh, and then the next one from the same exact company called, uh, same exact company as this one here, it's called BioLinks. And what this is, is a link tree alternative. Again, very similar. You can buy the regular license at $69. If you scroll down, I think the price is the same. The extended license is $449. Yep, $449. And what you would get is you would get this complete website right here. You would obviously change the logo. You can change the text if you wanted as well. Uh, but you would get the same thing. And what this allows people to do is create... Um, single web pages where they can have multiple links in a bio. Instagram and TikTok are the big ones. And if you scroll down, it's very similar to this website here. But if you scroll down, you could set up different, if you wanted to have two tiers, three tiers, five tiers, whatever you wanted, you could price it at whatever you wanted. For 450 bucks, you could have a complete, pretty much business in a box. Again, you have to send the traffic, to, you have to get the traffic to the website. You also have to provide the customer service. So I'm not gonna say this is easy in any way. Uh, however, the development, the software and all that, that part is pretty easy. You pay the $450 one time. Uh, from what I see, this company, Altem, I don't know how to pronounce it. They have fantastic, uh, they have great reviews and they seem to be very, very responsive with customer service if you need anything. So these are two other options for white label software. There you have it, 11 white label software tools that you can get started with today. Like I said, the one, uh, the, a couple of them were 449. Some of them charge a monthly fee, like Simvali I know charges a monthly fee and it's not that much, it's less than $100. Uh, I think they're 
white label pricing is about 30 bucks a month to get started on the lower package for Simbali. But again, they all charge different rates. Some of them have initial setup fee. Some of them, it's just a monthly charge. You just have to figure out which one, but check it out. If none of those softwares interest you, just go to Google and white label software, white label software for marketing agencies, white label software for whatever industry you're in. And you should be able to find a plethora of white label software that you can offer. Hey, if you like this type of video, make sure you hit subscribe down below. Click that little bell notification because I release two videos each and every week for your viewing pleasure. If you're interested in learning high ticket affiliate marketing, I got something just for you. Check out the link down below. It's called pissoffboss.com. It'll introduce you to a 15 day business builder challenge. It's seven bucks, but you're backed by a 30 day money back guarantee. You simply can't lose. It's going to teach you how to do high ticket affiliate marketing. What I refer to as the the perfect side hustle. So check it out down below, pissoffboss.com. As always, thank you so much for watching. I truly do appreciate it.